Hey guys, this is Dow Phoenix, and I figured I'd show a little video because a certain game came out for OnLive today. A certain game that people said would, you know, be something that OnLive could not pass, you know. And it's a uh, Super Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition. Uh, the reason why this game is one of the most important releases on the service is because it's the service's first fighting game. And, uh, you know, a lot of people would detract from OnLive and, you know, they would try it for themselves and it plays good for, like, a first-person shooter racing game. And they're like, yeah, that's fine, but what about a fighting game? Because fighting games require the fastest reaction time of basically every genre, you know, or at least fighting game fans claim. So I, I, I believe them, though, because uh, some of these fighting games are really crazy with uh, how fast you have to be to pull off maneuvers and stuff. So, we're going to turn to the computer, and uh, we'll see how OnLive does. Okay, so this is the OnLive screen. As you can see here, i got my mouse, and uh, I'm actually going to be using an Xbox 360 controller for demonstration of the gameplay. Um, so that you can kind of judge for yourself on whether you think the latency is acceptable or not. I'm going to make sure to have the controller kind of on screen while I'm playing. I'll just have to get my camera kind of set up a little bit so that uh, I'll be able to do this. But you can see right now the response time is pretty good. You can tell there's a little bit of latency, but um, I mean, no, no, no major problem for menu navigation. I mean, you can see this kind of latency sometimes in menus for localized gameplay. So uh, it's not too bad. You know, I can do that and that comes out pretty good. But how does it actually translate the gameplay? Well, if you watched some of my previous online videos, you know that uh, overall I think the service is pretty responsive. But this is like the first actual live, I guess you could say, demonstration uh, where you can actually see how I maneuver with the controller um, and how it actually responds on the screen, like how well it responds. So uh, we'll go ahead and get started. Okay, I've got myself a little bit of a setup. Uh, anyways, I have a Zelda lunchbox here that I'll be using so that I can, you know, show them the controller the entire time I'm playing the game, or at least I'm going to try to. Uh, so anyways, we're going to go ahead and just launch into the game. Now, bear in mind, uh, for one, I'm not a fighting game guy. I really don't play them too much. Uh, just to let you know, we'll go ahead and type in Street Fighter here. I just got to reach over oh, Street Fighter A yeah that's exactly what I'm looking for <laughs> and uh, here we go we got Street Fighter on there okay now you probably don't hear the on live sounds very much uh, I, I'm really sorry but I don't have any speakers except on my monitor and my monitor speaker is really really freaking stuck. It, it probably would have been louder if I had to use my headphones. That's how bad they are. Um, but anyways, let's uh, let's go ahead and try it out. Um, anyways, if um, if you like what you see here, uh, this game's only 20 bucks on OnLive for a limited time. Um, 14 bucks if you su subscribe to the Play Pack. And, uh, you know, because you get a 30% discount on the Play Pack. So, so a uh, pretty good deal. So, we'll, uh, See how it works, you know. Game's got to load up first, you know. Okay, so yeah, about 15, 20 second loading time. I mean, nothing special from what you would normally see, I guess, trying to loading a game from the start. But we can, you know, skip all that stuff. I know it's not exactly the most centered thing, but, uh, you know, I tried to do as best as I could, really, given my uh, limited resources and the fact that I actually have to show my hands, too, so keep those things in mind. Um, I'm going to actually turn the light off real quick. Um, okay, never mind, I'm going to turn it back on, because... Because you wouldn't be able to uh, see my hands that well. You know, I mean, you'll be able to see the outline of it, but yeah. Uh, pretty nice little opening animation. Uh, 
I remember Street Fighter all the way back in uh, Super Nintendo days. I actually uh, started from the very beginning. I remember playing uh, Street Fighter. Well, I guess not the very beginning. There's Street Fighter One, which nobody's ever played. You know, everybody knows Street Fighter Two is where it really started. So. Anyways, I played that on the Super Nintendo back in 1992, and that game was pretty freaking awesome. Um, so anyways, I, like I said, I never played this game before, uh, Super Street Fighter 4 Arcade Edition. I played, like, Street Fighter 4 before, uh, about a year or two ago. So anyways, okay, so now we're, uh, ready to start here, and, uh, I figure I'll go ahead and just do an arcade with... The enemy AI first. Okay, whatever. I don't care. Uh, <laughs> and let's just um, let's just give this a go. You know, uh, I'm not sure who I'm gonna play as here. So uh, here we go. There's a lot of characters. I really having a hard time. You know, good thing I get infinite time to figure out who I want to play as. <laughs> Uh, okay, uh, hmm. The Infinite Ken versus Ryu. How about we play as evil Ryu? Because I want to be evil. But I want to be Ryu also. Okay. So I get to change colors. Uh, why not purple? I don't know what the, this means at all. Um, I'm sure some Street Fighter fan can tell me. Okay. So I'll try both with the uh, thumbstick and the D-pad, and you know I know the 360 D-pad completely sucks. I get that. Uh, On Life has its own controller, which has a better D-pad than this for sure, like easily. It's not as good as the PS2 D-pad, but it's still pretty good. Let's skip the story. We don't want to watch story, okay? This is about fighting, you know. That's what fighting games are about. So I'm fighting Guy. Okay. After we do one of these matches, I'll do the online matches to show you how good the online play is. Okay. I'm not really sure exactly how to do all the controls and stuff like that, you know. But overall, the gameplay seems pretty fluid. I mean, I guess there may be a little bit latency, but... I'm not, like I said, I'm not a hardcore fighting fan, so I don't really notice it. So, I mean, if you are a hardcore fighting fan, um, online's running a little contest right now where you can uh, demo this game for free. And I believe that even includes playing it multiplayer. And you get entered in a chance to win a trip to Las Vegas to this, I don't know, this other fighting thing. I don't know. It, I have no idea, but... Uh, Hey, it's worth a shot, right? You don't have any money to put down on it. And um, online spectating feature can be really cool for, like, running an online tournament or whatever. So that might be something to consider there. Okay, I know how to do Hudoken. <laughs> I, like I said, I'm not very good at fighting games, but I know I know the basic moves like that. And uh, sure, you can. Dragon Punch, whatever you want to call it. There we go. So, yeah, I'm not having any problem... Uh, Surpassing a CPU on easy or easy medium, the default difficulty of the game. Um, I'm really not noticing the lag that you'd expect. So, uh, okay, um, not really sure how I can get out of the game here. Maybe I can pause. Okay, let's back out of this. And uh, I'm going to try to hop in on an online match. I don't know how many people are playing this game on, on live right now. Um, I guess battle is what I'm looking for. Okay, so I couldn't find my own match, so I decided I'll just start my own. And ready up, okay? We're going to play against Jasper, uh, whoever that is. Uh, let's stick with Evil Ryu. I think that's a good... good uh, character to go with here. Purple all the way. And it looks like they're playing as C Viper. Whoever that is. I don't know. Chick Viper? I have no idea. Uh, let's pick out a nice little stage. Crumbling Laboratory? Uh, inland Jungle. This sounds good. It sounds like 
um, Black of Stage. So, uh, um, apparently they've already played some. I'm completely new to all this. Hopefully they're not a complete freaking expert at this game. I got the early lead, but I know, I just have a feeling they're going to kick my ass. You know? Like I said, I'm not any good at this. Oh, they ran right into that. Ha ha. Ah, crap. I keep forgetting you have to use black, or black, back for a block on these games where it's Mortal Kombat, you have a block button. Ah, crap. They got me there. Yeah, I'm not doing too good here. Uh, I, I believe, I firmly believe, though, it's because of my lack of skill at these games, and not because of lack of playability. So, uh, I think uh, Ja has got that round easily, but I'm going to definitely do my best to ensure that doesn't happen again. There we go. Oh, you got owned. You thought I was going to do the dragon punch, didn't you? I don't know how to do this super crap. I'm trying to do the super like freaking maniac. I, I have no idea how to do it though. I don't know why. I do just play the game. Yeah, you can see this is like the totally not the epicest match ever. This is like the worst Street Fighter matchup ever. Uh, actually, probably not. I'm sure there's like way worse online matches done. But I managed to make it uh, to the, you know, the sudden death at least. That's not too bad. So we'll uh, see how this match goes up. Crap. Early start off. Okay, so the super move obviously is a close range move I have here. Crap. And they're totally freaking owning me there. She's got some weird lightning attacks. Like, is she like a chick version of uh, Blanca or something? Crap. Stop owning me. No! I need to get that super move in. Seriously. Okay, almost... Oh, yeah. You got me, huh? Ah! I should have blocked. Well, that was a pretty close matchup, but uh, definitely played pretty good. I'm I'm impressed. I have to say, uh, I'll definitely need to get some more practice here. So, uh, if you guys want to show me some tricks, you know, some street fighting tricks, um, or if you just want to, you know, whip my ass, uh, either way, uh, you know, hop on on live, uh, you know, they're doing, uh, free trials all weekend, I believe, for this, uh, and a little bit after that, I'm not sure, uh, they're also doing similar contests for, uh, Borderlands, um, you can play for free all weekend, and, um, Saints Row the third, they have, like, a five-hour trial, so you can play, like, a big chunk of that game before, the trial in, instead of like the normal 30 minutes so um hope you guys like this video uh with that guys down phoenix out